uh, interfaith dialogues are a great way of addressing these issues and also that you know uh, the different cultures and the different faiths have a lot to say about the five elements of nature and about how uh, saving the world is so important and it starts with very small steps like saving the environment for example in gurbani uh, guru nanak dev ji has addressed these issues as saying that pavan is guru you know wind is guru uh, water is like our father pani pita you know mata tat mahatli is god goddess earth is our mother so like that and you find similarities in uh, different faiths in different religions so that is the beauty of it that you begin to feel that you know all these great prophets and saints who came on this world had something to say for keeping it and making it beautiful and life is very precious and how to uh, you know respect the dignity of human life and the dignity of life the right to life of all the creatures on this world is so important the the world is facing a number of problems but they all begin from the mind um the greatest of problems uh, or greatest of conflicts let to let's put it this way must have begun in the mind of somebody and uh, if that person is of a great stature or uh, in in the worldly sense and has a lot of followers then the magnitude of that conflict spreads in no time because if a person has power uh, to control and that person has a mind which which breeds these kind of conflicts then that can be a big problem for the whole world uh, that's how you have seen in history how human problems started uh, they start with one person or a group of people thinking along a particular way and thinking that they are right and everybody else is wrong that's how it all begins so i think uh, getting the religious leaders together and uh, trying to find a common platform where um, all of us agree that spirituality uh, i would say rather than institutionalized religion spirituality is the core whether you find it through christianity through hinduism through sikhism i think the basic core of spiritual values uh, is kindness and uh, compassion so if we are able to reach that uh, through the dialogues of these religious leaders i think they can contribute a lot to world peace uh, i think today is the world of very fast communication and uh, social media plays a great role in that i think it has a very positive role to play in bringing people together uh, all these online conferences uh, that we are able to do now uh, it saves time and uh, expenses for so many people who would like to be together but do not have the time or the finances to reach across so you can get so many people together in an online conference then through social media through it can be put to very constructive use the only thing is we must remember that social media has a lot of influence and one wrong thing can breed misery for so many people at very short notice so we must refrain from uh, using it in an irresponsible manner so i think um, it can be very very helpful in bringing the world closer together thank you thank you so much